You're watching a segment of The Splash, Greater West Bloomfield's news magazine show. The Chaldean Cultural Center, located inside the Shenandoah Country Club, is asking residents within the township if they have official artifacts from Iraq and to bring them to their museum if possible. And The Splash's Katie Wozniak talked with the director of the center to find out more on its history and official opening. West Bloomfield is home to many of the finer things in Michigan, and soon it will be home to one more. The Chaldean Cultural Center, located inside the Shenandoah Country Club, catalogs nearly 5,000 years of Chaldean history. And the reason I'm involved in the Cultural Center is to help our children and grandchildren and future generations remember our culture, our history. Because of global situations today, we have lost a lot of our history, our culture, and uh, our people are no longer gathered in one place in any one part of the world. Our homeland is barely exists any longer. The Cultural Center's director, Mary Romaya, tells us a little bit about the audience the Cultural Center hopes to reach. One is um, our pioneers, those people who were the first to leave Iraq, leave the villages in northern Iraq, and journey to America. Made, and, and we're talking more than a hundred years ago. In fact, we know that the first Chaldean to come to America was in 1889 and he went to Philadelphia. It is speculated that the Chaldean people settled in Michigan for several reasons, such as Ford Motor Company advertising jobs on Ellis Island and Michigan's increasing population of Arabic-speaking communities in the early 20th century. So my family, as well as most of the families that originally came to this country, ended up working in the grocery store business and serviced a lot of people that worked in the factories at the time. The exhibits cover nearly the entire history of the Chaldean culture, from ancient times to today. The displays also cover parts of the different empires of ancient Mesopotamia. Uh, here we have um, a real stone from the very first church built in Mesopotamia, uh, which was is now is uh, located south of Baghdad, about 30 miles south of Baghdad. Uh, it was built by Saint Mary, Saint Mary, we called. He built his chair, this church around. Uh, we can say about the third uh, part of the first century. Many of the artifacts you see here are hundreds or thousands of years old, being bought from antique dealers from around the globe. All of these will be on display early November, when the Chaldean Cultural Center is expected to open to the public. For The Splash, I'm Katie Wozniak. Thanks for watching a segment of The Splash. To catch the entire show or other segments, watch us on Comcast Channel 15 or AT&T Channel 99. Or look us up online at thesplash.tv and listen to us on WBLD 89.3, The Lakes FM.